didn't think this through. What do you mean? How many Cokes are we going to get? We're going to get three per restaurant? Yeah, we're going to have a lot of Coke. It's going to be like 18 Cokes. 18 Coke. We got to do this for science. There's nothing scientific about this. <laughs> hey, wait, I... This is what the car looks like. Dude, it's so depressing. Wait, did you get my joke? So depressing. Which fast food restaurant has the best Coke? We're going to find out today. The answer is going to shock you. Wallahi. Wallahi. Welcome in, Habibis. To another episode of the A-Raps Podcast. Today, we are doing something insane. Frogan, what are we doing? We're testing cock. Yep. No, we're not. <laughs> we're cock. We <laughs> can't say that the first 30 seconds. It's gonna Easter get some... today. We can say cock. The Lord would want us no, to. No, it's Jesus the... got nailed for our sins. Yeah, it's true, baby. No, you cannot. You're... Okay. Yeah, you do Easter as well. I forgot. And you also do Easter. Yeah. Oh, my God. Okay. Today, we got a bunch of Cokes. Me and Scootish drove around. For an hour and a half, getting Cokes from every single fast food restaurant to answer the question, which is the best Coke? Like, mm -hmm. What's the best Coke? And there was two restaurants that were closed, <laughs> and we kind of fucked up. Which ones? In and Out. Uh huh. Is closed on Sunday uh, for oh, Easter. Right. And then Raising Cane's, we thought it was open. We drove up, and it said closed for Easter. <laughs> and then also Chick Fil A, okay, which hates gay people. Yeah, was also closed. Yeah, I love gay people. Yeah, but Chick Fil A doesn't. Yeah, but Chick Fil A. I mean, doesn't. their sandwiches are mid, anyways. They're not good. I'm mm -hmm. so fucking excited for this episode. I don't think you understand. This is gonna be one of my favorite episodes. All week, Frog has been like, I can't wait till I have a fucking coke. I'm not, so I'm on. I'm on a weight loss journey. I'm being healthy, so my and it's a journey. Yeah. I, the way you said it was like I want to do a little wink noise when I do the wink. Can we get sparkles? Yeah, yeah do it yeah, like the yeah, 1950s. Yeah, yeah. My kryptonite is Coke, Coca Cola. Um, so I've been cutting it out. <laughs> You sound like a Colombian drug lord who's like being questioned. I love Coke. Uh, cola, cola. Yeah, because every time they're like, oh, like Coke. No, I love Coca Cola, Coke. And I've only had it one, I only like having it once a week now. AKA okay. whenever we film the pod is typically the yeah. only time I'll have it. So whenever the idea was brought to us about uh, testing Coke, I'm like, fuck yeah. Fuck it's yeah. It's like your cheat day. It is my cheat day. The thing about Coke for me is it's like candy. Mm -hmm. So it feels like cake. So having it once a week makes sense. Yeah. You know, so like I don't, I don't have it very often, but I'm ready to have this. Okay. Because it's a holiday. I can eat whatever I want. Dude, I've been having big back thoughts lately. What does that mean? <sighs> what does that mean? <laughs> yeah, it's not, it's not, it's only a, it's only a phrase that you've come up with, with your sisters. It's never. No, it's, it's an internet phrase. It's basically like a fat bitch. Like you're fat as hell. Like big back. Oh, okay. Like a... So I'm a big back. I'm no, you're not a big back. Are you a big back? No, no. Me? Yeah, I am. But like. But wait, how are we not big backs? Yeah, a big I'm a back. big back. I'm like, I've got a bigger back than you. Yeah, I mean, his back's huge. Yeah. Have you seen my back? <laughs> my back is my whole surface area of my yeah, body. You have yeah, muscle though. Yeah, but do I not have a big back then? You're a big back. I don't understand this phrase. What does it mean when they want to blow your big back out? Yeah. Is a big they back like fuck a wheel? you while using your back eating wing stop. Mm. Oh, like my back's a table from Wingstop. <laughs> I gotta text. I gotta it's text messy. that person. Yes, then. <laughs> Who? No. no, who's that person? Who? Oh, oh, Scooty. You oh, Scoot? Scooty. Oh. You're saying Scoot's gonna blow your back out? Big your back. big back, my back. <laughs> no, so if, if you see a big back, you'll know. But basically, it's isn't a, great... a big back like a number one on Burger King? Wait. No, on I Donald's, think we right? mean Scootish ordered the big back. I get it now, I think. Yeah, it's it's basically like a fat ass like moment, like. Like, it's a phrase on the internet, okay? So, like, when you eat it, you become, like, the Hulk, and you, like, grow into, like, a... I know what you're saying. I don't want to be... I don't want to be fat-phobic. It's a... My but sister I get it. I do. It's Fucking a... lose weight. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> dude, this guy, got, this guy pulled out the Bill Maher, dude. No, <laughs> fuck <laughs> it. We'll do it. <laughs> but I don't... So, That's like... Bill O'Reilly. Oh, no, fuck. You're right. There's so many bills in power. Of fuck <laughs> bills. Of... What is... He's like... <laughs> Raph goes to the next bill. He's like, I did it's not Bill have Mar. sex with that woman. <laughs> Which one's Bill Maher's like... Oh, today we're gonna do like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's he's Bill a short real, for? He's a real what? Bill Billiam. No, Billiam. William. Billiards. William is short. For That's Bill. fucking stupid. That's how like Dick is short for Richard. That, that makes no fucking. Have sense. Have you met a Richard who wasn't a Dick? Honestly, no. Yeah, exactly. I don't even know okay. Richards. But anyways, big back. Mm -hmm. So obviously, like whenever you're dieting, you have to like eat healthy, whatever. So I was like talking to my mom the other day, and I said, "Listen, if I really fucking put my mind to it, I could eat a whole Costco pizza." Okay. And did you? 
No, I didn't do it? do it. Well, then you put your mind to it. That's what you talk about with your mom. You're like, hey, mom. And she's like, what? And she's like, is everything okay? You're like, I just thought about this. No. If I put my mind to it, I can eat a whole Costco pizza. <laughs> but I looked at it. It's 5,000 it's 5, calories. And then I was, I was like, well, yeah. Oh, that's your meal for four weeks for you. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> and then my mom was like, I couldn't do Costco, but I could do Little Caesars. I was like, speaking of Little Caesars, I could slam like five packs of crazy bread. And then she's like, I could give you a coupon if you want. I'm like, bitch, no. Like, this is just a conversation of a hypothetical. I don't want to actually do a, a Little Caesars mukbang right now. <laughs> We're just having a conversation. What the fuck? <laughs> and, then, and then I brought this conversation to my sister. And we're talking about the Wingstop 20-piece meal deal. I could never finish that. I've tried. I can't. But if you give me 20-piece McNugget from McDonald's. Do you ever think when you start talking, where did you start and how did this get here? I know how it started. We were talking about Big Macs. From <laughs> <laughs> McDonald's. Right? <laughs> We're talking, we're, talking about, we're talking about my cheat day. The best is when we asked you. I was like, Frogan, we went to like seven restaurants. Can we just get you like, I want, I want McDonald's. I'm like, we can get you anything else. You're like, nah, like I'm going to pass. Like I asked you for this. Please get it. And like, it was the one that was out of the way. I'm like, fuck, man. It was so fucking worth it. All right. I, I, have you Let's bring I, it. I we haven't had a Coke yet. I literally sat in silence eating my chicken nuggets. I'm so confused though because like. I brought it up because of my cheat day. And those are my thoughts I've been No, having. but like, what was this conversation with your sister? Oh, yeah. She was saying that, like, she could slam a 20 piece McNugget too, but the Wingstop meal deal is something that you consume throughout the day. I can slam a six, six inch. A sage? I could slam an eight inch. What about you? Two. I'm weak. <laughs> Pussy. Wait, what's, what are the inches for? Subway. Oh. Oh, I can slam a fucking foot long. A foot long. <laughs> Back in the day, what was your Subway order? Because I used to always get either the meatball. Or I always got the. Or well, last, got, night, I, like the last night I went up Rogan's stream. I want to talk about this before we get into this. I went up Rogan's sure. stream and started yelling at her about going on dating apps and meeting a man. Did you not do it? Dude, it got. I don't think I could talk about it on the pod. It got so bad. You got heated? It wasn't. No, it got heated in the way, the, the good way, but also a gross way. Think about it. Think about what I just said. It got, it got steamy. Ew. What happened? I was like, <laughs> Frogan's like, Frogan, Frogan on her stream's Frogan like, remember, and she's Frogan like, literally last night goes on her stream's like, yeah, I crave dick. I'm going to no, say. No, I'm going to say why. Because so, we were talking, we were having a conversation. Oh my God. Bro, I <laughs> swear to God. <laughs> she's <laughs> like, I crave it. You know? No, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you exactly what I said because I remember. I try to get her to buy a bad dragon dick. <laughs> I'm not going to fuck a bad dragon. My, my coochie- What about a good dragon? I can't handle something. I found one that sounds, looks just like the snail that Rogan cried about. <laughs> so, so let me tell you what happened. <laughs> it looks exactly like Because we were talking about like dating, whatever. I was like, I just don't feel like I have time right now. I just don't feel like whatever. And then somebody in my chat was like, have you ever entain- entertained the idea that you're asexual? You know that sets me off. So I was like, no, I know I'm not. I'm like, do you guys want me to talk about how I want to gobble a fucking dick every single time I'm fucking horny? Because I'm not going to do that. This is what I had to be. This is what I had to deal with last night. <laughs> Do you have those thoughts? Like yes, that? she does have those thoughts. She's been saying it for a fucking hour, dude, the whole time on the on the fucking stream. How does a Muslim Muslim woman satiate themselves? Just like any other woman, or do they have to like? Is there like a certain protocol? Here? There's no pro. That's insane, Dad. <laughs> if you want to get technical, you're not supposed to. Me neither. My mind went blank for a second. I apologize. <laughs> so now what? What do you mean now what? Now no, we bring so, now, so who's cock are you gobbling? Nobody's. Bad dragon. I don't want to. F- no, we talked about bad dragon the first episode. I could not fit a 16 inch. Nobody could. I don't How do you know? You push a 16 nope. inch out. It also had a tube. What has a tube? A cum tube. So you could breathe? No, so you can shoot cum into you. Dude, okay. <laughs> if we get this podcast at three- <laughs> Don't talk. <laughs> if we get this podcast at 3,000 subscribers, share it with your friends. If we get it to 3,000 subscribers by the end of this month in the next 30 days, I will buy the $150 one with the cum tube and we'll spray each other with it like hose. <laughs> For the Patreon. We'll put, well, I'm make us get we'll down put on our knees. We'll put, no, yeah, I'll do sli- we all agree? No, no, I'll slime, all I'll slime the Nickelodeon style. We all agree. Get in, get in. <laughs> That's probably not a good joke. Agreed, man. agreed. I wasn't thinking Wait, about what did you say? I, I said I'll slime you Nickelodeon style, but I forgot about last week's episode. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
it's about... Dude, we were watching Anthony's podcast. He made the most fucked up joke I've ever heard in my life. I'll show you it after. I'll show you it after. It it made me cry laughing. I sent him a video of us dying laughing. Anyways, yeah. I'm not asexual. I'm sick. Like, just because I don't talk about shit, like, openly, I don't understand why people accuse me of it. I already know exactly what you're thinking right now. I'm actually not thinking anything. (laughs) No. I was, I'm thinking about something you told me the other day. What did, what did I you? say? The Lou Bloom thing. <laughs> <laughs> Frogan, for, yeah, Frogan came up with this idea to like, with Game Pass to like figure out how to gaslight me. It wasn't with Game me. Pass. He was helping me tweak it. Oh. I told Capri, he said it's genius. It wasn't genius. So. It didn't work. What was it? When the, you heard trying ab- to gaslight me? About the food. About how I let him. No, I told you how to gaslight Raph. You want me to do it? Yeah, do I'll, it. Don't say what I told <laughs> okay. you. Okay. Yeah, do it. I'm not, I'll do it later. Okay. But yeah, I basically said uh, this. Just re- just remember that I'm gonna gaslight Raph later later. Someone's, okay. someone's here. I know we derailed the Cokes, but like Oh yeah. So basically whenever we're hungry, like, oh, what do you want to eat? And I'm always like, I'm down for whatever because I hate making decisions and I don't want to pick. Okay. I don't want that decision on me. And he gets irritated with it. I don't get irritated. Not irritated. I'm... He I just know that that's what you're going to say, but I still have... Uh, you know what I get mad about? What? That I still ask you. And I appreciate it. Yeah, you're welcome. So I came up with a reasoning as to why I feel like he should be honored. I say I'm down for whatever. Yeah. Why? I'm a strong, independent woman that likes to be in charge. Okay. So I'm giving him... No, please continue. Because <laughs> I'll tell you exactly where you fucked up. Go ahead. Continue. Please. Please, I'm already getting, I'm already don't, feeling the phantom don't, anger. Don't worry, don't charge. worry, I'm, don't worry, I'm going to add it, I'm going to add it the best part, okay? Go ahead. Raph, <laughs> Raph is a man with big muscles. Keep going, keep going. I'm not Finish understanding what's going on. No, 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 it, it doesn't get any better, but. <laughs> you like my shirt? I do like your shirt. Can you keep your ADHD thoughts to your fucking self? That's a good shirt. <laughs> finish, this, finish this how you're gaslighting me. <laughs> okay, so as a woman that likes to be in charge, I like to make all the decisions. So the pro- thought process I'm approaching is he should feel honored. I'm letting him pick what we should eat because I trust him as a big, strong man with muscles to pick where we're eating. And I trust you so much that I don't even have to think about it. Okay. So here's what you did not say. You didn't say you didn't say any of that. What you did say in the beginning was, Raph, I'm just a girly whirly, and I want you, the man, to decide where we go. <laughs> because you're so big. You're so big. And and I was like, big, like I know where where I want to eat. And she's like, no, like strong, like muscles. I'm like, okay, so that's not what you said. You said I'm a big man. And that you don't want, you want to give me control you because Raph, you're a woman. Did you call Raph fat? She called me fat and also was sexist to her own people with, on the last day Raph, of the Can I be honest month. with you? Yeah. You have gained like a little. I have. It's, a lot. And it's been like your pants haven't been fitting. Stop. Right. No, my pants actually stretch. No, stop. I know that's not true. right now. No, I know that's not true because my pants well, stretch. I know. I know. He, that's how he's trying to guess. Like, that's, <laughs> <fucking mean. laughs> that's how you guess like Raph. I told you. But it's not working. Uh, yeah, no, but it was going to work. What do you mean? I, you stopped it halfway through. Yeah. How is it going to work? I said the though? way you gaslight Raph is you say something very specific about one little part of his body. Just like be like, your glasses are a little bit too close together. They are. <laughs> He'll think about it for hours. <laughs> They're not. They aren't, though. I'm not Frogan. Frogan thinks about it for hours. because Days even. Because I said sometimes when she talks, I was trying to imitate her. And I said I was trying to do the talk. And I was like, oh, sometimes you just sound like Lou Bloom from Nightcrawler because that's where you emotionally peaked. Yeah, that makes sense. You haven't thinking really, about yeah, it. Yeah, doesn't make sense. Let's bring in the cokes, okay? <laughs> no, I'm not done. But anyways, yeah, like, don't you comment below? Don't you think you should feel honored that I let him make the decision because I'm a strong, independent woman that always and is then in on control? the flip side, do you think it's do you think it's awful that I am giving trying to get, ask my friend what she prefers and she's trying to relinquish control over me and holding me hostage? I'm giving, I'm giving you the control, Scootish. Let's start off with <laughs> the first one. Let's start off with Burger King. All right, Burger King, Burger, Burger King, King, easy. Burger I got King, the straws Burger here. King. We're gonna start out with the Burger King. I do want to drink these cokes. That's why I wanted to bring them in. Thank you. Everyone, get a Burger King. So we all got a Burger King. These are the subsequent straws for the Burger King. I don't know if these are the right ones. We mixed up all the straws on accident. Straws do matter. Straws matter. Comment down below if you think straws matter. 
Straws matter. It only matters if it's the dark okay. paper shit. Oh, scoot. You gotta adjust Rose. Yeah, okay. Right, okay, let, let so... Me get that, let me get that ASMR of the straw going in. <laughs> Did you already drink it? No, I, I let my mouth simmer over <laughs> it. In, in the... <laughs> the, the fizz? <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's not good. Okay, so this is the first one. We're raking this on a scale of, let's say, 1 to 10. Okay. Uh, and then we could put, like, have Draftster put up a little graphic. Okay, let's go. Ready? Sure. Cheers. Sure. Wait, ch ch cheers, yeah. motherfucker. You don't you like to touch our cups. You are a fucking big You guy. don't even want us to touch your cup. Why are you doing this? No, I'm going to bounce the <laughs> bottom, dude. Cheers. Cheers. Here we go. It's no. dull. Oh. Mm -mm. Give me McDonald's. <laughs> no. I don't like that. Mm, I don't like it. It tastes like black licorice in Coke form. Mm -hmm. No, I like black licorice. It does not taste like black it's licorice. It's better to take the ice out because you can taste it in its purest form and it's not good. It just adds to it, though. No, it doesn't. It adds water. Mm -mm. This is tasting at its purest form. I don't like form. it. This is purest from its form. See? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he said, this is what if I just don't like form. Coke anymore? This is good because then we're, we're going to boycott with Coke. Uh, okay, so I'll give that a three. I'm going to give that a two. I'm going to give it a two. As yeah, well. That was gross. It was what, like... What, 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 let, let's... Let's let's simmer on that a little bit. What did it taste like to you? Did it was it flat? Do you think kind of. It, it tasted flat. Maybe it was um, in the car too long. No, I don't think so. Uh, it was flat, and usually Coke's. Eat it also has like a very like rough beginning taste. Yeah, it tastes it tastes like depression right it on. It was like face. really spicy for some reason. Yeah, it tasted like allspice. Yeah. Ooh. It tasted like a little allspice. And I like allspice, but like not in drink format. <laughs> yeah, it's not good. It's not the. It's not a good one. It's I don't like this TMJ. one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can feel that too. I can feel it in my jaw. It's like I feel like I got flash banged in my mouth. Oh, you're so inappropriate. Okay, let me get these next three. So the next three are going to be from Carl's so Jr. These were the most expensive. You, Burger you King was one of the cheapest. <laughs> these three cokes were seventeen dollars or something like that. Eighteen dollars for three cokes. These were eighteen dollars. This is the most expensive. Was it scoot? Did we order anything from Carl's or was it just like 18 bucks? We ordered things from Del Taco and we just this was $18. Okay, this is eight dollars for a Coke. $18. Yes, yeah, for three, like it was like 17 or something. So it's like 18 dollars. Why is it so expensive from Carl's? I don't know. Carl's is, is it because it's always been the most expensive fast food place? They charge like restaurant prices. Can we talk about how before we, we started the podcast, he Capri touched me with his foot on purpose? And I, th I thought it was an accident, but his foot lingered, and I, I feel him staring at me, and he's just smiling. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Expect the unexpected. Hold on. I think the straw open. I can't function. Okay, by the way, go, also some of the parameters the of this, uh, this conquest is that we oh. had to order a medium at every place that we went to, uh, and we had to get three Cokes without ice, so they're the exact same no matter what. So, And each one of them were mediums. So this is Carl's Jr.'s medium. Uh, only one place didn't have Cheers. a medium. They had a small. Oh, what? They're, they're so different. I need ice. This one's like smoother. This one's smoother, but there's no, there's no flavor to it like the other one. The other one fucked my mouth. This one? I don't like it. Oh, my God. This feels like a diet. <laughs> ice, anybody? <laughs> Please. Garçon. <laughs> Garçon. Wait, where'd you get this ice thing from? My house? <laughs> also, I don't know why you fucked me. Why? I why why is mine with no ice as well? I have ice in the back. No, you don't. I brought a whole thing of ice. So we Where did you get ice? From my house. So we could fill up the cokes with ice. You just brought house ice? Yeah, house ice. Why? Because house ice is the freshest ice. It's on the house. What? It's on the house. <laughs> why don't you just get a cup hey, of ice? Hey, guess why what? Why don't you just go to McDonald's and get a large cup of ice? Can I ask you? I didn't think about that, but can I tell it's you something? It's fine. I was joking. The ice is on the house, you know? Oh, my God, dude. Your ice machine's fucked. Yeah, that's why my fridge broke. Why did I grab one? Eat it. I don't fucking want crunch it. Crunch it. Crunch it. That's okay. I'm good. I'm good on ice now. Crunch Ew. it. No, eat it. Oh, you don't want to know what I put in my freezer. Dude. Just spit what? it in the Burger King one. What's Your wrong? ice is awful. What does it taste like? Here. It smells, too. Put it smells in. Smells weird, huh? It smells and tastes like food. <laughs> no, it really does, dude. Here, put it in the cup. Oh, it does smell like food. I probably had some, like, chicken wings on top of it. You put chicken wings on top of your shit? You put, 
You put stuff on top of your ice? You really put stuff on top of your ice Not holder? all the time, but I need to. What do you mean you need to? You have a freezer. Put it in the fucking freezer. Why are you putting it on top of your ice machine? Because my ice machine is in the freezer and I run out of room sometimes. Oh. It tastes like it tastes like this garlic salt. <laughs> it's my favorite. <laughs> I give that get the fuck away from me. I give that a three. What did I give the other one? Burger King a three. Which one's three worse? Two. Wait, which one's worse? I think the Burger, Burger King King's was worse. worse than that. I think Burger King was a three, and this one was a two. I give this one a. I think we're going through these too fast. Should we go slower? We should like maybe like talk about. I just hold on a second. The ice. Well, yeah. What the fuck is your? Issue? I don't know what's wrong with it. Okay, my freezer broke for a while. Smell it. Smell it. Smell it, I'm serious. <laughs> Smell it. See? <laughs> I gotta wash my hands. <laughs> Dude, it's fucking gross. <laughs> Why did you act- Do you see what I mean? Like, I'm not faking this shit. Here, smell this, Scoot. <laughs> Bro, no, you need to smell I was, it. I was in the car with it. No, I, I know I smelled it enough. I just wanted to come in here and say I was with him the entire time when we had to go back to his house and he brought the ice. I was like, why'd you bring that? He's like four ice. I told him we can buy a bag of ice from McDonald's for a dollar. Not I even. Told we him just that. fucking get a, a large. Yeah, no, ice. he knew, he knew that. He knew we could have gotten fresh ice from McDonald's. Yeah, he's got a this piece fucking of garlic pepper fucking ice. <laughs> ice. <laughs> that just smells so Dude, it smells like chicken wings. <laughs> That's so insane. <laughs> Why Bro, did you? You got that garlic uh, parmesan. Dude, it's so gross. <laughs> he has the garlic parmesan. Did you really have garlic parm? Because it smells like. Dude, it smells like garlic parm. <laughs> <laughs> it's really bad. No, don't laugh. It's so funny. I'm actually concerned about you. Why are you doing this? Dude, this is no. fucking awful. Hold on. Whenever I found out it was his ice, that's why I said no, because one time I tried getting ice, I swear to God, white shit came out of it. No, that was at... <laughs> no, it was at his house. Dude. <laughs> Dude. Bleep out. <laughs> oh, and then the bleep this week is going to be this. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, go this is that. fucking gross. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, dude, it's like one of those oh, things. I need, a so- I need a soda pal. Dude, pal- it's pal- like one of those things. Like that's gross. <laughs> good. Okay. What do you think is gonna be the best what? one? You know, you like you smell something. It's like it's bad. It's a bad smell, but you keep smelling it because it's like just like <laughs> so gross. Lie. You know what I think it is? I think that I got vegan chicken nuggets and I left it on top. Why do you put anything on top? Why do you put anything on top? I ran out of room in your freezer. Yeah. What do you mean you ran out of room on your freezer? My freezer's not that big. I'm fucking crying. Okay, let's bring in the next soda. <laughs> Scootish. You have a big uh, which fridge. Which one do we want? Do you have Carl's two drawers? You, no, Jack in the Box. Let's right, try Jack, Jack in the Box. Jack in the Box. Jack in the Box is a local staple. I like Jack in the Box. I had a, I, I got, I got mini tacos okay, from there not is, too long ago. This was the first place we Thank got you, from. Scoot. So if this one's good, it's because it's been in the car the longest. I have more time to ferment. Thank you. Okay, so. <laughs> I don't like this. That's a good. That's a good movement. Oh yeah, you're on one today, dude. Who? Capri. Did you know how many fucking people I had to talk to? One lady dropped the soda on the street. She was just staring at me eating a, a sandwich in the car. It smell. This Coke smells like the Coke that's fake Coke. That they have the machine that has like the seventeen thousand different flavors, and then the they, freestyle. Yeah, All I right, can tell. I can tell right off the bat that it, sm- it cheers, smells. Like I may that. accept it before you guys. Oh, Ugh. I don't know. I think this one's the best one so far. This is the best one so far. Ew, no, it's that fake shit. No, this is the best one so far. It's not good. But it's the best one so far. And it's been in the car the longest. I give that a two. You give it a five. I'm going to say four. Mm. Are you just saying any lower that's any number lower than mine so you can be contrarian to me or what? No. Or do I you just, really think it's a four? I think it's a four. What are we like? What's like the best Coke? Like what's 10? McDonald's? I think, I think from the no, can. I think, Mc- I think Del Taco is going to be number one if I had to guess. No, no. But I'm saying like what's our like, what's our like Mexican Coke in a bottle? Mexican Coke in the bottle. Okay. I think I agree. Ugh. But it has to be done with like a nice cup of ice that doesn't smell like garlic parmesan. 
<laughs> Dude, it's really bad. I don't think I can go through the rest of this go fucking wash podcast. Your hands. No, I don't have time for that. All I have time for <laughs> is this. Go wash your hands. How long are we on this pod? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> We're 25 minutes in. <laughs> we fucking already derailed the fucking bitch. If you're listening at home, I'm so sorry. Also, subscribe. We never say this in the beginning of the podcast, but you should subscribe. Oh, yeah, okay. or if you're listening, just listen to us some more. Yeah, on Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like that one the best. Yeah, Fogan I think that still one's doesn't a four. like it. No, Fergus doesn't like it. I think I might be dying. That one was cheaper too. That one was one of the cheaper ones. It was, was nine dollars for three of them. Worth it. And look at the size. Okay, look at the size difference between this one. This is and a the medium. Carls. And the Carl's that was seventeen dollars. This was nine dollars. Yeah, that's insane. Like, look at this. Yeah. I don't need to grab mine. You no, guys you are should. handling it. It's good it. content. Grab it. But I don't want to grab. Grab two of them. I don't have enough hands to have a mic. And Now what do we do? <laughs> Just look at each other and go, oh. <laughs> okay, those are nasty. Can you hand me um? Okay, which one do you think is going to be the best? One of the holders or a couple of the holders. So that way they're not like flopping around over here. I personally, right now, flopping. I'm not going to lie. They're all really bad. You're a pervert. <laughs> exactly what I didn't want to happen. They're all bad. <laughs> Scoot, they're bad. Okay, here we go. They're bad. There's no ice. Yeah, but Coke without ice isn't going to be that bad. Yeah, it is. Mm, I drink them out of the can Can we have another ice. holder, please? I drink my Coke without ice. Ew. What do you think? We're doing it without best? ice. Okay, you guys want to try Wendy's next? Yeah, Wendy's, Wendy's. is going to be shitty. You think Wendy's is going to be shit? Wendy's is my favorite fast food restaurant. Uh, let's try Wendy's. They don't look good. Huh? I, I think they, oh, they look watered down. Ooh, this does not Ooh. look good, actually. Thank you. Thank you, this sir. This is a large. This is a medium as well. Ew, why is it like the way it's like looking against the light? Did Scooch give you mine last because I'm a woman? Yes. Yeah. He gave mine last to me last, last time. <laughs> last. I'm joking. I'm obviously joking. I respect Dude. women. It's not women's history this month looks anymore. Like a, Stop harping yes on it. Yes, it is. This looks like a carbonated iced tea. It does. Which one do you guys... Like, so far, the Jack in the Box is the best. Scientifically, I think Jack in the Box, my rating is a four. Scientifically, maybe you're giraffe, a bitch. Maybe giraffes are we just keep the ratings on the bottom from, the, for, from now on. It's the best. It's good. Wendy's. Good. Mm-hmm. We did grab this one kind of last. I think this one was also eleven dollars. Is it diet? Scoot, close the door. Miles is staring right at me. I think it's like a six, solid six, yeah. Uh, this one's this one's the best. It's good. It's good so far. I give it a five. It's the best for Frogan too. This kind of tastes like diet, right, Frogan? Yeah. It might be diet. We ordered regular. That's so it. Wendy's Wendy's shit. tastes like diet. I give this like a three. This tastes like diet, dude. I hate diet Coke. There's no, it's no sweet. The sweetest one so far for me, like, which one do you guys think was the sweetest so far? Carl's. Carl's was the sweetest? Yeah. The sweetest for me was this one. This was the sweetest. I Burger hate, King? Burger King was I'm fucking I'm not gonna gross. lie, I hated them all. Your bitch ass dog's fucking up our Coke review. Sorry. Well, it's because the door was open and he was just staring at me. Yeah, it was. Okay, we'll bleep that out. No, keep that. No, in. say it. You have to say. She can say it. Bleep me out. Leave her in. So yeah, well, I don't want to do the next, the next one. one. Wait till the the this guy. Children. Oh, we're just gonna wait. What, so if we we just, like, what if we just pass it around over here so we're not in front of the cameras? Oh, I think it's funny. No, let's go. Cool. Uh, la, 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 you know. What? Give it like right, two that was seconds. Carbonation. You're kind of a gross person. What do you mean? Your fingers smell like garlic parmesan. And you're just yeah, burping. but that's not my fucking fault. That's my. <laughs> that's not my fault. <laughs> he left the door open. <laughs> I'm gonna go shut the door. Okay. All right, let me shut the door. Actually, no, I'm gonna shut the door. Okay, go shut the door. Okay. No. <laughs> now he's gonna be awake. He's sick. He thinks you're playing. He just got a beanie baby. <laughs> <laughs> Who gave him a bee baby? You did. It didn't it was in the thing. Oh. Oh, when I came in the office, I think it's a toy. Oh. That's not a toy, that's a beanie baby. That's a that's a collector's item. Oh. You better get that you better get that collector's that's item. That's Nanook. Huh? 
Huh? That's Nanook. No, it's not. It's a dog. The, Nanook is the dog. Okay, but how much does it go for? In the future will be a lot. No, I don't think so. This is Nanook. When did you? Well, who got you a beanie baby? In 1995. One time, this is from 1995. I'm not joking. Time, this is and, actually from when I was like five years old. One time an ex of mine got me a beanie baby for graduation. And I was always confused as to why she got me a beanie baby because she broke up with me. Mm-hmm. Um, and I held on to that beanie baby for a long time because it was a parrot. And that was the end, really the end of that story. Can I tell you something? Yeah. You're a sick freak. How am I a sick freak? Move on. She doesn't want you. She doesn't want me. I don't want her either, dude. Do you like my shirt? <laughs> Ask me one more time, dude. I'm going to change my answer. I, I went to the store the other day and I got fitted for this shirt. You did not get fitted for that shirt. What's that oh. for? <laughs> this podcast is completely derailed and I'm, I'm down for it. What the fuck? We're going to have to cut a lot of this. No, we're not. We're going to keep it all in. Okay. Oh, my God. What? Great. Now my Scoot, hands close the like door alcohol. all the way. Now my hand smells like alcohol and fucking garlic <laughs> fucking parm, dude. Alcohol and garlic parm. Dude, it didn't help at all. It made it worse. <laughs> you, probably, you smell Italian <laughs> now. <laughs> I'm Italian. So I finally is smelling my <laughs> I smell like Dude, fucking that's Italian. the worst smelling hand sanitizer the one that smell like wet potatoes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wet potatoes. My favorite one is the ones they made out of vodka and this shit smells re- <laughs> it smells like tequila piss. Like it's like, what is this? All right. All right, let's do our next one. Uh, let's do our next one. I think I think uh I want to do El Pollo Loco. Okay, that's I think El Pollo, Pollo Loco is gonna be the best. I don't know about that. I think it's gonna be the best. <laughs> Thank you. He beelined it for you. He's like, I don't want fucking Frogan coming after me. Did you smell it? I did. It must smell like a garlic parm. <laughs> I smelled it because you could smell if it's that nasty fucking machine. Okay. Here. <coughs> You realize it's all syrup and soda water, right? All right. While he's going out to pee, we're going to do this next one. El pollo loco. <laughs> oh, did it slap? I felt like that I, one I slapped. didn't even drink it yet. Okay, okay. Wait, did you drink it? Cheers. This is the McDonald's straw. God damn it. I spit it back in my cup because we didn't. <laughs> Good job. What I like about this well, one. We like it. This is also. Is it has is, ice. This is a small, by the way. They didn't have a large. They didn't have a medium. I don't think I like Coke anymore. It's a leash. Uh, right it's right there, on, there the on, your, on your desk. I don't think I like Coke anymore because none of them have tasted no, like they taste bad. good to me. They taste bad. No, I don't know. This actually doesn't taste that bad. Five. You think this is a five? Mm-hmm. I give it a four. So far, this is the best one. No, I don't know. Wendy's is still pretty good for me. I think this one for me is a six. I'm going to mm-hmm. get the other ones. Oh, my... This is a six. Oh, why am I breaking out in hives? Because you're excited. For what? I don't know. I got to freshen up, though. Welcome to this lackadaisical podcast where our host walked just right in front of the cameras. Um, Rogan, if you you need any allergy medication at all. Thank you, Icon. I'm sick and tired of working with you allergic motherfuckers. I need allergy medication. I need this. I need dogs. Well, I'm allergic to a bad attitude. I'm allergic to you. Well, I'm allergic to you. Trying to gaslight me for what? I like what? this one the best. I like it's a five for me. I say six. It's a five. It's a five. Okay, it's a five. F- Frogan got bored and started organizing. <laughs> yeah, what is going on? Here? <laughs> She's organizing now. <laughs> no, I'm like putting them all next to us so we don't have to wait. Oh, uh, okay. Organizing. I have two fucking hands. Yeah, grab yeah, one. Uh, Just are, grab. Are yeah, you, okay. Wait, are you organizing? No, grab. Make sure you grab both. This is still fun though. I'm having a good time. This is a good time. If put co- put comment down below if you're watching this on YouTube. Um, and our which one do you think is the best in oh your my opinion, God, dude? This is gonna be another terrorist. Oh attack. Jesus Christ! If you're listening to this on Spotify, we are just tasting cokes right now. Um, it's, this is really fun though. This is a good. I it's like a good this time. a lot. I'm Frogan really right like now this. is walking in with. Oh uh, my God! With. Two holders. Okay. Oh my god! On top of each other. Yeah, I can move your pillow. And she's yeah, gonna we try have to. Winter snitch will come in. When's through? the last time you squatted? When's the last time you took a squat? 
Oh. Can I tell you something? That was good. I'm going to say that Del Taco is going to be the best one. You think Del Taco? Yes. I think Wiener Schnitzel is going to suck. How much is Wiener Schnitzel? I have Schnitzel? good knees. Wiener Schnitzel was uh, a $9, $11. I just, can I have, a, I want to make a comment to the both of you. These are I mediums, hate the way the you way. guys treat your, uh, your mics. <laughs> you just don't throw them everywhere. You don't give a fuck. You know you're supposed to dent supposed your to, shirt. You're supposed to dent your shirt. It sounds better. I think somebody dented their shirt and was like, "Fuck!" And they're like, "No, you're supposed to do that. You're supposed to." Do that. And they got embarrassed and made that thing. And now really? everybody does it. Cause, cause why? You know, because uh, it probably. Because why wouldn't they just pre dent it for you? Because it loosens probably the, the filter. Thank you. Know. Yeah, there's not a good reason. Ugh, I don't, this one looks slimy. Which one? Del Taco. Del Tacos is gonna be the best. Did she spill? <laughs> she spilled all over. Stop! <laughs> There's one right here. <laughs> what are you doing? Don't squeeze. Literally the thing I didn't want to happen. I didn't squeeze it. I firmly gripped it to try to grab it. Here. My stomach is rumbling right now. Are you hungry? It is Might Easter and we're recording a podcast. I'm really proud of us. Can I be honest? We've been very consistent. I've been having a great time with this. Okay, here we go. Ready? <laughs> This is going to be my favorite. Cheers. I guarantee you. This Del, is the Taco. Best Del, Del Taco. Del Taco is the next one. Del Taco. Okay, here we go. Cheers. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> I said it. Oh, wow. Mm. What do you think, Frogan? It's my favorite one so far, but it's I, sweet. I'm going to be real with you. It's too fucking sweet. Mm. I, I, I think I'm dying. None of them taste. <laughs> it tastes. It's really nice. Yeah, it is. It's, it's not as crispy as I like it. Yeah, here's the thing. It's more syrup based. You know what I'm doing right now? I'm eyeing down that McDonald's one over there. Do you think McDonald's where is going to be the Where I see the best? carbonation. I want it to I want it to flash bang my fucking throat. Not like you I guys can't are so wait. perverts. <laughs> well, stop making the fucking joke then. A flash bang is a bomb. Yeah. I never said I wanted somebody to throat fuck me. So what? I you said, want Arab cock who gives a shit. You want explosive penis. This is our podcast. Uh, Del Taco is so far the best. Del Taco is really I good. I agree. Scary. I give it a six. We have to rake this all together. So so far, what do you think one was the worst one? Yo, I don't remember. The Burger worst King. one, Burger, Burger King. King is the worst. Burger the King best so far, Del Taco. I would say Burger King. Then after Burger King, Carl's Jr. Yo, I'm getting oh the my shakes God, there's right like now. Fucking just puddles all the sugar. of yeah. fucking coke everywhere. Did Ralph spill coke? No, Frogan did. No, <laughs> I was I was just legal named you on accident. Why? You've never legal named Yeah, me. because I need to make my fucking point. Frogan spilled all of them. How are you getting the shakes? I've only had like three sips of each one of them. Yeah. Capri had a cup of coffee before he even tried any of these, which I think is insane. I, don't, I haven't really, I don't really. I don't know what's more insane about Capri. The fact that he has to have three cups of coffee a day or the fact that he fucking puts chicken wings on top of his goddamn ice tray. The chicken wings? Yeah. Miles is just, Miles is going crazy today. Sorry, sorry everybody. It's okay. Who gives a shit? Let's see. It's we're. <laughs> Can you imagine us screaming at your dog? <laughs> Let's All try right. Wiener Schnitzel. We have Wiener Schnitzel now. I've never been there. I don't know what's going on with is them. It bad? <laughs> Scooters just had one extra Wait, which one. Which one did you have? Wiener. The Wiener Schnitzel. Yeah, the Wiener Schnitzel one. <laughs> Let's all try. This. Is it bad? You just go play with them. That syrup. Give me your. Uh... Do the cams need to be reset, Scoot? Uh, no. We're having a day. Yeah. This might be a short episode, chat. Why? If I fucking say chat one more time, I'm, gonna, I'm honestly going to hang why we were supposed We were supposed to have our guest on what? this week. Oh, no, don't say that. Don't it's okay. yell while we're recording. Sorry. I love when Scoot fights your dog. It's, it's great. Miles, you fucking idiot. Tries, like, to, tries to reason with him. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Ew. Why did you already taste it? <clears throat> Excuse me. It's there a lot go. of carbonation. This, this is a bad. lot of Coke. I haven't had this much Coke in a long time. Ready? Yuck. I don't know why, but I feel that one in my nose. This is this is two. <laughs> this is equivalent to Burger King for me. So far, it's Burger King, this, <gasps> Carl's. Carl's and Jack in the Box are tied. Wendy's. Del Taco. Look, he's like questioning Del Taco his fucking at the top. life. <laughs> this is really bad. I can't even take another sip of it. It's bad. <laughs> Coke. Why did we do this again? 
It's a good idea. I actually am enjoying it. Brogan's having a bad shirt day. Okay. Brogan. Wait, wait, why are you gripping your stomach like that? So far, my. Oh, Brogan just pooted. Brogan just pooted. No, I didn't. I'm holding my buttons closed. Brogan, go get the. Goddamn... I, the song is loosen up your buttons by Pussycat Dolls, not fucking hold my buttons closed. <laughs> Drive through Taco Bell. But if I loosen up these buttons, the tits are going to come out. Loosen up my buttons, babe. Uh huh. You ain't frontin' me. Uh huh. Say what you gonna do to me. I think me. you guys are fucked up on the McDonald's shit. I don't think it's gonna be as good as you I think. never really liked McDonald's. Jeez, I need like, a palate cleanser. I'm like excited about it. I need more coffee. Ew. Telling you to loosen up my buttons, babe. Uh huh. Did you guys, um. So far, so far, this is. Did you guys hear about that Arab guy? Yeah. You hear about that Arab? I think it was a Twitch streamer. I hate him. Arab Twitch streamer, like, apparently got kidnapped somewhere. I don't know where he got kidnapped. Is anybody? He got kidnapped in Haiti. <laughs> they should have kept him, honestly. <laughs> so silly. Um, but did you see his tweet? It was like, I was kidnapped and whatever, whatever, whatever. And then he was like, that's why the only flag, that's, I, I never prayed to a rainbow flag. I'm like, how did you equate homophobia to, <laughs> to getting kidnapped? And I was like, good, I'm happy you actually got, if you did get kidnapped, I'm Bro, glad, if you got dude. kidnapped, the only thing you're thinking about gay people, you gay. Did dude, he... who'd you get kidnapped by? Wyclef John, dude? <laughs> Fucking get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Fuck, that is the that best is one. The best one. Th this, is a, this is a fucking 10. That's a good one. I hate the it fucking It is the sand. last one we got, so it may be that it didn't get shooken up as much. No, McDonald's has the best fucking Coke. Like, they literally have special, like, temperature control for their fucking Coke. Okay, yeah, this is way better than the rest. That's such a good Coke. It's... Imagine if you had ice in it. I ain't, no, I can't think about ice anymore. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're a 40-year-old man. You should be embarrassed about that. I'm not 40 what? This is so much better than the rest. This this one, these are the best. That that was by far the best. But I think that's also is the last one we got. Yeah, it is the last one we got. The second Coke. to last. <laughs> I have nothing else to say. It is the last I don't one think we got. Like, I was about to say Coke is my favorite. Uh, the McDonald's one was the best one. But I'm gonna be completely honest. Can we I do Sprite now? I don't think I can drink Coke. Ooh, a McDonald's <laughs> Sprite will make our bodies fucking screenshot. I think that, like, honestly, that was the worst experience ever. I'm not drinking Coke for the next year. I'm gonna drink Coke tonight. That was actually that was pretty, that was pretty gnarly. It was disgusting. You guys want to line up all the cokes in the in the front of here? Can no, the, no, I don't want to do that because I know your long ass legs will probably kick it over. I just want to kick over some coke. Don't kick over cokes. I'm, there's already a mess over here. I have to clean up, dude. What um? They all what taste else been, so different. What else has been going on this Jojo week? Jojo fucking Siwa. Oh yeah, tell me about her. Have you heard about? Have you heard about this? <laughs> This is our Easter episode. This is like a good episode to show you that like not everything goes according to plan here. You know, it's fine as long as we. You know, I'm honestly this week is a good time. We were supposed to have one of our my, one of my friends on, and then he's gonna be on next week. Mm -hmm. So next week you guys are gonna see Josh Elkin on, who's like the guy. Um, it's gonna be a really fun episode. But then we switch for the Coke thing, and it's been honestly this is great. I have a great time. Yeah, it was a good time. Yeah, you guys are in for a treat. We have we have back to back guests. For the next three weeks. Yeah. Okay. Tell me about Jojo Four, Siwa I think, because actually. I don't understand why everyone's mad at Jojo Siwa. Oh, yeah. Talk to us about Jojo. Yeah. Do it while you're doing your lip liner. Yeah. So Jojo Siwa is in It's her... gloss, actually. Mm, I understand that. You wear gloss <laughs> instead of chapstick. Okay. So Jojo Siwa is in her bad girl era. Think okay. like Miley Cyrus. We can't stop. Do you know Jojo mm -hmm. Siwa from uh, yeah, like, Dance Moms or whatever? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What the fuck was that? Have you that? not seen her fucking intros to her YouTube drafts? Her, I'm gonna send you the video. Cut it in. Hey everyone, it's Jojo. Welcome back to Jojo's. Every single one that is guys going to stop Twitter. Then I'm going to do something. Oh yeah, she does talk fast. I don't know, so I just, I need a burp. Oh, gotcha, 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 gotcha. And then it's and then someone uh, edited it with the fucking Nigel Thor Thornberries. <laughs> 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 But yeah, she's in her bad girl era. Okay. Um, so she's releasing a song called Karma. Mm, and, yeah. Um, she's like trying to a get... A little Taylor Swift much? <laughs> Karma is my boyfriend. Mm -hmm. Karma is a god. Okay. I got the lyrics wrong. Karma is a law. Isn't she gay? Who, JoJo? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, she saying Karma When did she boyfriend? come out as uh, gay? A long time ago. Long, that's oh, a Taylor really? Swift okay. one. 
But anyways, yeah, so she's basically teasing, like, the choreography for the video, and everyone's, like, making fun of her on TikTok because it's fucking stupid. They're like, aren't you a dancer? Like, why is this shit? <laughs> oh, that's so mean, dude. That's so mean. And then, like, she just wants to be a bad girl, you know? She wants to be like. I've been. That's How like, old is she now? She's like twenty three or twenty one or something. Oh. That's like me saying like I'm a bad girl. Well, this is Everyone what happens. Everyone fucking laugh at me. Okay, but this is what happens. P- people are child stars, so people see them as children for the rest of their lives. So they're like, oh, now I'm gonna exude my sexuality because I'm in my twenties and I want to like be that. <clears throat> and then when they do that transition, it's fucking weird because it's like, you know, you grew up watching a child and like, ah, oh, it's fucking. Can weird, I play a dude. clip of the song? Yeah, yeah, play it. I think. Play that, it. I, I don't have my that, phone. <laughs> Dude, fuck the day. You have your phone. My phone's right here. I asked 20 times if we could make it short, and Frogan's like, I'm gonna talk about something, but I don't have the fucking music. She has it geared up. Just don't look, don't click that private folder. Don't click, click that private click folder. Five, I do click it. Stop. What's in there? Ah, it's dick. just pictures of me throughout the years. Naked. <laughs> hey, what does it look like? I have, I have a, I have hey, a Rolodex. You know I have a really good idea. A for content. Dick. Can I, can I tell you what I want to do for content? Yeah, I want to take. You know how people take a picture of themselves every single day for like ten years? Yeah, I want to do one ten years, but I'm naked at all of them. <laughs> <laughs> so you want to do the content idea of a joke that I just said? Yeah, yeah okay. but like, but like, you know, like the dick will just drip. Oh, it gets longer. <laughs> <laughs> Same photo, but you Photoshop your dick getting longer. <laughs> Okay, go. Oh, man. Are we going to get copyrighted for this? Yes. We're not going to be able to play it. Patreon. No. It, we're, we're, on, we're not on the Patreon. We're not on Patreon. Okay. Okay. I don't want to okay, listen to it. I don't want to listen to the whole thing. I need you to go to the chorus. I skipped to the chorus. It's we a one minute. In, it's a one minute. Skip to the core. I don't want to get demonetized. We're going to get fucking demonetized, Frogan. Okay. Here we go. Ready? There's some camp rock shit. I can't listen to this. Pause it. Come as a bitch. What did she ever do bad? Karma. Cheat. She cheated. Oh, yeah, she cheated. She had, like, a new girlfriend, like, once a week. Oh, yeah. Her dog got eaten by a coyote. I think that's negligence. No. That is negligence. dogs all the time. No, but what's your dog doing just out and about alone? Yeah, if you know you live in a coyote-ridden area, why don't you protect that shit? My friend. It's all about the coyotes. My my friend uh, on the east side of the United States, they live in, like, the woods, okay? Yeah. Not only do they have coyote vests, their dad goes out with a gun. A coyote vest? You cannot what is stop that? coyotes. Me and Scooter saw one in front of Scooter's house the other day. We chased it. It was huge, Did you, wait, right? What do you mean the other Wasn't day? it big? It was big. Oh, <laughs> Scooter's about to fucking beat the shit out of your dog. <laughs> he bit the fuck out of him. Oh, did he? He's in a bad mood. Today. Oh, he's not, he's not doing good right now. Keep his ass home. He's not doing a good job right he's now. It's okay. Good. He was doing good all week. No, but the past he, month, he's been he would good. literally stand outside with a gun in case coyotes yeah. come. I'll never forget the first time I went over to their house. Like, I was in the kitchen. He walked out with, like, an AK, and I was like, what the fuck is this? Okay, well, that's not helping. You don't need an AK for coyotes. What are you doing, fighting the KGB coyotes? Or AR, yeah. I mean AR. AR? What yeah. are you just doing? Well, what didn't Napoleon doing? Dynamite fight coyotes in the movie? No. Like, didn't he say he fought oh, Wolverines? Was that it? You guys remember Napoleon Dynamite? Yeah. He's like, yeah, I went to... <laughs> yeah, I fought your shirt. Yeah, I went to... Yeah, I was fighting. I was hunting coyotes in the. What, or does it say coyotes? Or does it say what, werewolves? I, werewolves. No, no, he likes ligers. He's hiding, hunting something. I werewolves, need a wife beater. All right, just just marry any Arab man. Are you guys wife beaters? No. If I had a wife, I'd beat her. No. That <laughs> joke. Bleep it. No, no let him say it. No. no, leave it out. I'm taking a book. Uh, listen, my favorite meme I tweeted the other day. Nobody thought listen, it was funny. I can what take was a the punch. Meme? Huh? I could take a punch. Okay, cool. You can barely run without getting a fucking hamstring pulled. Or you getting, got without by, getting a you, Charlie you chased, horse. You got chased by a homeless guy across 25 I feet. I had just woke. Okay. Woke? <laughs> yeah, I, had I, just, I had just woke. I just I woke just, up. I just worked out. I 15 woke out. incline on the treadmill. Yeah, so not, you should have been fucking prime. You should have been in your fucking thing. You no, been bro. Running. I didn't fucking stretch or anything before. So I was whenever I was going home. Well, how did you run? Like, ah! I I, see on that. the treadmill, I do... 15 incline, 12, or I do it for 30 minutes, 15 incline, and then I do it like 2.5 speed or three. I have short legs. 
I've been going to the gym every day. You proud of me? No. No. I'll be proud of you if you go every day for a month. I'm on day five. Good. Don't go every day. Go go at least three days a week. That's what I'm doing. Okay. I've been just trying to go into the gym. I said this about the gym the other day. Which I think is ridiculous. Because if I step foot in the gym and then I leave, I'm like, people are going to think I'm leaving. I'm just like, don't want to do this. Yeah, you don't want to. But I do want to. Okay, can I explain? Frogan, we talked about this. I've been to the gym in two months. Me and you had a conversation. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I said, if you just go into the gym and you get in the habit of just going, it's better than going in there and working yourself out and then burning yourself out and then not showing up for a year. You literally go in there. You just walk in, you walk out. That's all you have to do. That's so weird. But what a waste of time. It, it's, it, it doesn't matter if it's a waste of time. You're trying to build it into your routine. If my routine is I go home from work. No, because it doesn't build into the routine. Because you're not your routine, allocating the correct but, time. Yeah, because if your routine is just showing up there and then leaving, you're not allocating. Yeah, exactly. You're not allocating the right time. Because then what happens if you, <laughs> what happens, you can't fucking tell me what, anything about working out when you put fucking chicken nuggets on top of your ice like a, like a fucking are, are sociopath. Gonna him, are you going to let him do that to you? He can do that all he wants. I did it to him earlier today without him looking. <laughs> did you do that? I did. <laughs> Your glasses look like shit. Dude. No, they don't. That's no, a they fucking look lie. Really stupid. You're trying to dude. gaslight me. Again. You look. It's not work. You look like. You know what you look like. Hmm. You look like a turtle got glasses. That's what you look like. I feel like a turtle. That yeah, that's what you look like. I'm look... wise. I'm fucking big body. You know what I'm somebody strong. said Raph looked like in my chat one time? What? Buff Arthur. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, you know what you look like, Raph? You look like I'm part uh, of the community now. <laughs> what's that really bad movie with the guy from uh, Wayne's World that? Mis- uh, Master of Disguises. That's what you fucking look like. Oh, um, that's an awful Garth? movie. Garth. Garth. I miss wearing glasses. What happened? I got LASIK. Uh, poor thing. Yeah. What about you? I wear glasses. I just lose them all the time. Mm-hmm. I why- bought two pairs, dude. This might be so boring to listen to. I got bought two pairs for $170. It's not boring to listen to. We tried a bunch of Cokes, and now we all have sugar highs. <laughs> I don't think I have a high at all. No, I'm fucked up, dude. What would you do if I started coming into the podcast with fake glasses? I would be upset because we have to re-light you. Yeah. Oh, true. I mean, I paid a lot of money for my eyes. How much? 45 Dollars? hundred. Oh, I was going to say, that was a lot. It was like twenty three fifty or 2250 per eye. Didn't I tell you that my cousin did that and they, they cut a nerve and then she got fucked up for like five years? Yeah, and that's why I'll never do LASIK. The only issues I've had with my LASIK, um, so I got it done March last year. Uh, whenever the weather started changing in Michigan, my eyes got severely dry to the point it felt like I was like blinking sandpaper. So I had to get my tear ducts plugged. Mm. And now they're plugged. Yeah. I saw this one thing a long time ago where... I think the guy I saw, like, he got, he got, like, sunburn in his eye. So they had to, like, take out his fucking, um, the lens of his eye, mm-hmm. like, which is, like, which hides, I think, like, where you have, like, your iris is on the outside and then there's, like, a thin layer that's a, that's a, that's a, a lens, right? Yeah. They took it out and put a different one in there. And he saw, like, perfect. And I was like, why don't we just, is that, like. That's another option. That's another option. Yes. So my thing is, because we saw that, sur- he, like, made us, it was a science teacher. He made us watch the surgery, which I thought was, like, fucking stop making us watch this gross-ass cool mm-hmm. shit. He, uh, it, 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 it's super fucking invasive. They, like, go into your eyeball, and you're awake, and you have to, like, just keep it open. And then they, like, take the lens out and then put a new one in your side. Yeah. Did you ever hear about what the time that, they, that I had, to, I got glue on my eyeball? And they had to Wait. scrape it? They took out, oh, yeah, God. dude. Did you ever tell you this? Yeah. Oh, God. I got, okay, I'm going to tell it for the point. Wait, hold on, I hold on. I, I was going to say, but like, yeah, that's a type of LASIK. Okay. Like, they put like a permanent contact in your eye. Yeah. Uh, mm. The one I got is the laser where they reshape your eye. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, te- the testing to see if you even qualify for LASIK is very intense. It took me three hours to get tested. Ugh. Uh, But whenever I did it, before we talk about the glue thing to wrap up the LASIK. No, no. Um, yeah. So whenever I went in for surgery, I just wanted to get it the fuck over with. Uh, so what they do is they give you a Vicodin. Mm-hmm. Nice. And you're supposed to let it simmer. And then they numb your eyes and then they do it. I didn't let my Vicodin simmer. Mm-hmm. I'd pop that shit. I was like, just take me into surgery. Um, so whenever you're getting your LASIK done, they cut your eye and you go blind. Like for like temporarily. Well, yeah, I, when you're like blind. That. I went blind. I just saw darkness. Really? I saw like shadows. And Ooh. I had a, I had a full fledged panic attack. Because my Vicodin didn't kick in. Is being blind like closing your eyes? No. For uh-huh. me, it wasn't. Is being blind like 
opening your eyes but not being able to see anything. Hmm. Yeah. It was weird because it was like I was seeing shit and then all of a sudden it just went. I just could only see shadows. And then I just started freaking the fuck out and they were they stopped. They cut the like, white balance of your eye. <laughs> <laughs> no, but dude, it was so scary. But then like they did they like sealed it with a laser or something and I could see again perfectly, like right after. But yeah, it I like scares it. the shit out of I me. I remember when I went under and like that was like the one that was weird because like it's not people say it's like sleeping, but it's not. It's like no time has passed. And then when you like wake back up, like all the first thing I was like fucked up when I did the surgery and then I woke back up. The first thing I did, they were like, are you OK? And I couldn't open or move my body. <laughs> and all I could do, they were like, are you awake? OK, wake up, like blah, blah. And I'm like. And I just gave like a little thumbs Wait, up. What surgery was this? My nose job. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, when my dad had surgery, I was there. He called a nurse SpongeBob. And I'm like, I'm like, you can't be doing that shit. I know you're on drugs right now, but he literally said you look like SpongeBob to the fucking nurse. Did she look like SpongeBob? To him, probably. Did she look like SpongeBob? <laughs> Did she look like, <laughs> she she look like SpongeBob? Kind of. She had a bunch of <laughs> why she had a bunch of holes. She in her. had okay. big ass eyes. Okay, I'm a, I'm, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's SpongeBob. That's some SpongeBob shit. Here's here's my story about the eye surgery thing. Yeah. I woke up and there was something fuzzy in my eye. Mm-hmm. And I couldn't see out of my right eye, and it was just fuzzy. And I was like, and it felt like you ever wake up and there's like shit in your eye and you keep rubbing it and you can finally see. Imagine that for like eight hours and you ca- I kept rubbing my eye. I couldn't see shit. So I was like, what's wrong? So I finally like run to the optometrist and they're looking and then they're like, hey, man, you've got glue on your eye. Were you messing with glue? And I'm like, what? And they're like, no. I was like, no. What happened was I, I sleep with a sleep mask. So I washed the sleep mask and then the heat melted the glue. So it got off and went in my eye. Mm. And oh, eye. So when I go to the doctor, they were like, we got to scrape it off. And I was like, what the fuck? Ugh, and, okay. you, and you would think that they have like a professional scraper or something sensitive, like a little piece of plastic. No, like a razor blade, right? They busted out a razor blade, like a real box. You know the true box cutters that are just like a stick? Yeah. They look like a Harry Potter ass razor blade, like a stick with a little razor. Mm-hmm. They busted that off and then they just go and they scrape your eyeball. Oh, I fucking, I can't. This is why... I, this is why, like, I've always contemplated being a doctor, and then I, like, I just can't. I can't even fucking sit through that. Oh, when you see it, you're like, when he busted it, he's like, yeah, we're just going to scrape it. And I was, I was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, I thought he was fucking with me. I was like, ah, I got to have him in the air. That's what I do that. And he was just like, he's like, no, we got to scrape the glue off. I was like, what? What the fuck? You don't have, like, technology hasn't advanced. Like, you don't have, like, hey, man, just put this, like, little, like, patch on your eye for a week, and then it'll come off or something. You know? He's like, no, no, no. I'm just going to go in there. I'm just going to cut it off. I'm like, what the fuck? That's insane. It worked. <laughs> so, you wanted to be a doctor? A long time Did ago. Did you want to be a doctor? I wanted to be a pharmacist. Okay. Do you know what kind of doctor you wanted to be? No. Heart surgery. What kind of doctor do you want to be? I wanted to be a gynecologic oncologist. Right. That's, like, where you can see into the vagina. It's like, uh... Is that right? Like, Did I nail that? Where you can like look inside of a vagina. No, it's like cancer. Like when you put it's eyes like inside of a, oh, and everything wow. it's, around it's, like it's, breast it's, cancer. Oops. It's so very cancer. cancer. Uterine oh. cancer. Oncology I, it sounded is like cancer. A, it sounded like a surgery, like where you like put eyeballs inside of a vagina. To see no, what's going well, she on. said gynecologist, which is the vagina doctor. Then oncology means cancer vagina mm-hmm. doctor. Yeah, oh, gotcha. I wouldn't want to be a gynecologist. I feel like some people become gynecologists to so like make people feel fa- pain. What? What? Pe- I I glitched out. Some people become gynecologists to make people feel pain. What? I, you're not, this is not working on me. He wants you to elaborate. I want you to elaborate. I'll elaborate. Dude, imagine you're going for an exam <laughs> and they crank you open with the speculum. It's like a metal thing. What? They crank you open <laughs> and they don't lube it up. <laughs> oh, I can't, dude. I can't this week. They don't lube it up. Okay. So imagine a cold metal thing going in your vagina and then getting it cranked open. Then you have to get tickled. I've always been that cold metal thing going into vaginas. (laughs) Cause I, (laughs) I'm not doing it this week. No, put your foot down and put your head down. I I go to the guy in college all the time to get sounded. (laughs) (laughs) No, they crank you open. No lube. Dude, it's Easter Sunday. Like, I don't give a fuck. Let, yeah. Continue. Crank you up with no lube, and then they have to take samples <laughs> of your cervix, so they stick, like, a long-ass Q-tip in there, and they, like, tickle. They, like, go around in circles. Isn't that how they, like, found COVID in women? <laughs> no. So, technically, you lost your virginity. Oh. No, I didn't. I didn't lose my virginity. 
I actually had a long talk with my doctor after that because I was like, "You did it." No, I didn't lose my. Why are your hands so warm? Sweaty. Yeah. Clammy. Because I'm nervous <laughs> about <laughs> vagina talk. It's your vagina. No, I mean, there's people who like say that shit. It's like so stupid. But yeah, no. They- <laughs> What? Why did you say it like that? I, like you were a higher I had, dude, dude, I thought, I've heard people say that's like so stupid in a way. <laughs> it's so no, stupid. No, my fucking like, mind. Uh, they're like, they don't use lube because they don't want to like fuck up the sample of the cervix, whatever. Mm-hmm. Thank God you only have to do it once every three years now. Well, good news is like you'll never have another man. Wait, why cervix. only once every three years now? What? Because there's. When are you gonna get a big dicked individual? What did you say? I said, well, good news is I'm not- done talking to Raph for the day. Yeah, okay. I said, <laughs> I what said, did you say? I said, well, good news is you'll <laughs> never have another Sweetie, person. There's no, there's no help for you on this side. I I'm said, be honest. I said <laughs> good, good news for you is you'll never meet a man who can hit your cervix because they're all small penis. My cervix lays low. <laughs> <laughs> I have a very low pelvic floor. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't. I made that up. Oh, well, thank you for telling me. <laughs> thank You're you for welcome. letting us know. You're welcome. How high is your cervix? Capri, if you had a cervix, how high would it be? 34 inches deep. That's deep. <laughs> your trachea. <laughs> your trachea is your cervix. Uh, right here. Oh, God. But yeah, no. Mm-hmm. Fuck pelvic exams. Yeah? Mm-mm. Yeah. I don't, can't remember the last time I went to a doctor. Really? Yeah. I was just at the doctor. I forgot what for. I think I went to the doctor before I moved. What was it for? I don't remember. Just to make sure she had all of her distemper. Wait, why is it every three years now? Because um, if he, so basically what they're testing for is HPV, mm-hmm. which is uh, sexually transmitted. Only people, like females, can get tested for it. And it's like one of the number one killers because, yeah. So get your HPV shots. Gardasil. How do I know I have a habit? Oh, uh, you can get tested. You can't get tested the, if you're a man. I can. Like the shot. Like wondering if you have the shots. Yeah. They could test levels oh, in your body. Oh, the shots. Oh, I, I don't um, know if I've ever had that. It was a, mom. Mom, have I ever gotten an HPV test? Oh, speaking of your mom, shot. you you gave a she gave you a box. That's for, for the bo- pa- that's yeah, for the she bonus. did. No, it's for the bonus. okay. We're sending a Patreon. Yeah, mom got me a an Acer box for the Patreon, and we're gonna do it on the Patreon. Did Listen. you did you just scootish me? Look, here goes the hands. Here go the hands. Off. See, here go the hands. Remember when I said the hands? Stop. <laughs> Listen. Did you just correct me? Remember, no, remember I said she. Had, no, you weren't there. I said you have like Trump banners. Are you trying to end the episode right now? No, no, we're just saying that's gonna be on the Patreon. Do you not want? Hey, if five people sign up for the Patreon because of what I just said, I want you to Listen, do it right now. My biggest Frogan fucking wrong. pet peeve is whenever we're in the middle of a fucking like thought point and then you cut it off to try to talk about something else, which is what you just did. No, I was just trying to promote in the middle of the thought point. Wait. You know what? You want to have a you want to have a house meeting right now? You want to fucking go yes. right now? All right. <laughs> All right. My biggest pet peeve is we have to go in order. There's no order today. There, there is an order. Pet peeve. All I'm, I'm saying, saying is, the back for this one. All I'm saying is he wanted to end right after the coke thing. Because it's <laughs> did, Easter. I have one. my family. You know what? I'm airing you out. Okay. What did I text you yesterday? What'd you say? It said, since we're not having a guest today, ask your family what you're doing for Easter. And then we recon- recon- But my family already booked the restaurant and then they canceled because I wasn't a- a- appearing. And then they asked me, why didn't you book again? But they did it two last time. You of just a said minute. that they had extra tickets. The, you, only two tickets, and I was already here in the office. Also, tickets for a restaurant? Like, what restaurant were they I don't going know, it's to? Easter Sunday tickets. But yeah, so I said yesterday, I said, coordinate with your family, and we can record it later. Masbut walalat. That's yes, but the problem is my family already had booked, so then I would have been leaving my friends on Easter. I would have left one of you behind, and why would it? Why would we leave Scooter? We wouldn't go. No, we, we wouldn't go with, with you. We, we wouldn't don't go, have with to you. go with your family. It's it was you. Just been you and your yeah, family. but the thing is, we, why are we? Why are we involved in your family? Because I, you guys don't have any family. It's sad when you're here by yourself. It's Easter. Who gives a fuck? It's sad. I'm gonna go to any other hotel and just fucking go do their Easter egg hunt, steal all the eggs from little children. That's what I wanted to do today. <laughs> You didn't even say sorry for killing Jesus today. And you don't he even believe. He deserved it. No, he, he didn't. Some motherfuckers walking around being all like, oh, listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> listen, 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 listen. 
telling me. He fucking killed him. He was Trump, dude. You're telling me if a 13 follower motherfucker claimed they're huge and famous nowadays, you wouldn't point and laugh at them and want to kill them? Okay, well, want to kill them is an insane thing to say. Whenever I, when I had 13 followers on Instagram, people yeah. wanted to kill me. Did you feel like Jesus? I felt like Jesus. I had 13. One of them turned on me. People want to kill you all the time. You're basically modern Jesus. Whoa. I wish somebody would nail me. Oh, my God. <laughs> and all I hear is <laughs> saying, my husband's okay. No, yeah, pe- people threaten me in like the weirdest ways. Like, What do they do? I mean, they threaten to rip my scarf off. Well, they just want to know what's under the hood. A lot of Medusa. Do. Yeah. I have hair. <laughs> I'm not bald. What if you have one of those hairlines that starts here? I think she does. <laughs> I made this joke before. Yeah, he made it the other day. I did. It's right here. <laughs> I'm not fucking Benjamin I saw, Franklin. I saw, I saw one of the uh, girls from Love Thank is Blind. You, uh, and, like her forehead was like uh, just Sorry. a cranium. And I like, I looked at her. I was like, I wonder, Brogan. I have a normal. You saw my hairline. I've never seen your hairline. You saw my hairline. I look at you in your eyes and that's it. I've not seen your hairline. You've presented you just, your you, hairline to us, but we don't look at it. We look, we're mm-hmm. respectful. We look here. The only hairline I've seen is your eyebrows and your eyelashes. I hate that. men so <laughs> much. I literally hate men so much. I could go on a Rogan. three hour long oh my podcast God, you about should, why I hate men. You should definitely go on a three hour long podcast, but we should save that for the Patreon episode right now. He's doing the thing. I'm doing it because men will explain to you why you shouldn't hate them. Why are you them? sitting like that? <laughs> because I'm blocking her from yelling at me. <laughs> Guys, this concludes this week's episode. Thank you. Look this is the uh, Easter Sunday. No, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> no, no, no. Why are we ending? We're ending because 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 Miles is freaking out. We are we're ending because Miles is freaking out. We also need to go and have Easter dinner. We also need to film the Patreon <laughs> and we need to open up your mom's box. Okay, I want to Don't see what's inside that. your mom's Don't box. Say we're gonna see exactly box. what's inside Raph's mom's box. My mom box. wanted you to say her box. I want to dig around Raph's mom's. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you want to get into his, his mom's box? I respect her. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for respecting do you want to see what's in the box? No, my queen. I'm sorry they're disrespecting you like that. What I don't, am I doing? I don't, res- I'm I don't not disrespect doing anything. you like that. And this is why you love me more than you love Raph. She right. said that. That concludes this episode. That concludes this episode, 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 episode of the podcast. <laughs> <Bob Gans. laughs> oh, you see how much dust came out of that? That was so gross. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got some cool things in here. First things first, we got some we got some grass from the Easter Bunny. Mm. Yeah, or Pesach. What did we get? What did we get? Okay, so we got... Uh,